guys welcome back to my channel and i hope you guys are doing great in today's video i'll be sharing with you guys what no one tells you about dr Tew's lotion this lotion has been quite popular among beauty influencers on tiktok youtube instagram and the likes dr Tew's lotion is actually very moisturizing very hydrating so if you want a lotion that will give your skin you know that extra boost i would say go for dr Tew's, you know lotion this lotion is also very affordable you can get it for as low as 4500 naira to 5000 naira depending on where you're getting it from but i think it's within it's around 4000 to 5500 naira i think within that price range but it also depends on where and who you're getting it from but it is a very affordable lotion so everyone says dr tews is good is this is that is this is that but this is what nobody tells you about dr tews lotion so before i go ahead to mention the things you are not being told about dr tews lotion i would like to give a brief story that inspired this video so my neighbor walked up to me about um, i think about a week or two ago and she was like she needs to speak to me about you know something she was like oh okay i i i saw this lady on tiktok and um this lady claimed that dr tews um, made her two shades lighter so she went ahead to get dr tews from the supermarket she got dr tews she got dr tews from the supermarket and the lady actually um reviewed the dr tews lotion with vitamin c so my neighbor got the lotion and she used it she used the first bottle it didn't work for her she didn't get lighter she used the second bottle same thing so someone recommended her to get this one this um Dr. Tews milk and honey, milk and honey lotion. So she got this one. This this is the one she said she was using currently, and she was still not getting results from it. So she was like, she doesn't know, know what to do and all that. So I was like, so what what exactly is your complaint? What exactly is your complaint? She was like, she's not happy that the lotion did not lighten her skin, that she's not seeing changes. So I asked, what changes? were you expecting she said um she's not getting lighter <laughs> i don't know how to you know hold back my laughter because it's actually very funny so she was like because the lotion the lady reviewed contained vitamin c she believed that that was what made the lady's um skin two shades lighter so the lady even did a before and after and claimed that dr tews you know did the magic i had to explain to her that dr tews containing vitamin c does not in any way means it's going to lighten your skin we have about six types of vitamin c we have the l-ascorbic vitamin c we have the sodium ascorbic phosphate also known as sap we also have the magnesium ascorbic phosphate also known as map we have the sodium ascorbate we have the calcium ascorbate and we have the ascorbyl permitted. These are six types of vitamin C. Of all this vitamin C that I mentioned, the most potent one is L-ascorbic. And another thing, um, people in skincare will, would understand this, that vitamin C is actually um, very effective in a product when it is used at 10%. Some persons use vitamin C in a lotion as high as 15%, but from 10%, it should be like effective to an extent. This lotion right here is 532 ml of lotion in this bottle. Let's assume that this lotion is 500 ml for the sake of easy calculation. That means that if this lotion contains 10% vitamin C, 10% of 500 gram is equals to 50 grams. That means this lotion should contain 50 grams of vitamin C, C which is 10% of 500 grams. Do you know how much 50 grams of vitamin C is? Well, let us check from a website not even a nigerian website let's just check because this product is um is made this product is made in usa so let us check how much they sell 50 grams of vitamin c in the usa so i'm going to go to a particular website and check for how much they sell vitamin c So vitamin C here is $7.40. If we are to convert it by the exchange rate of six months ago, which was 680 Naira, 
that will be 680 times 7.40 which is about 5000 naira for just the vitamin c only we have not talked about the other ingredients which was used in this product the bottle the packaging the shipping and the interesting thing is that you can't just add only vitamin c to a product there are other active ingredients i need to add to make the vitamin c work better in the product this simply means that the amount of vitamin c in this lotion is just for aesthetic purposes or for marketing purposes it was never meant to lighten your skin in any way in any form or even give you a very significant brightening if it were meant to lighten your skin or brighten your skin it will not be sold at that price it will be sold at four thousand or five thousand or six thousand for a 500 ml bottle that is why you see a serum containing vitamin c and it's going for as high as 15 to 20 thousand naira those serums contain 15 percent vitamin c 20 percent vitamin c let us look at this on uh, lab vitamin c for example it contains 15 percent stabilized elascorbic and it goes for 21,963 naira let's look at um baudema this is 15 ml do you know how tiny 15 ml is it's half of 30 ml and it's going for 18,000 naira 18,352 so as you can see that if dr tews was meant to give you that significant brightening it will not it will not be sold for that price dr tews lotion is meant to moisturize your skin it's meant to hydrate your skin if you exfoliate and use this lotion you definitely have a radiant complexion a very radiant complexion but two shades brighter two shades lighter whatever it is is a dream that will never come to pass trust me except you want to start adding things into the lotion but dr Till's lotion on its own would not give you that kind of result please don't be deceived so the first thing that nobody tells you about dr Till's lotion is that it does not brighten or lighten your skin significantly it's a lotion that moisturizes and hydrates your skin and with regular exfoliation your skin will look radiant but significant brightening or lightening no so let's move on to the second thing that nobody tells you about dr Till's lotion if you have a dry to very dry skin this lotion might not really be beneficial for you if you have a normal skin to combination skin yes it is good for you it's going to moisturize your skin hydrate your skin i have a combination skin type and uh, sometimes i experience dry skin on my legs yes not every time but sometimes sometimes i experience dry skin on my legs so this lotion i took from my neighbor i tried it on my on my leg for about a week so I noticed that the lotion moisturizes my skin from the moment I apply it on my skin. But after a few hours, I noticed that my skin returns back to being dry. And I don't have a very, very dry skin. So if you have a very, very dry skin, a very, very dry skin, or a dry skin, Dr. Tews might not be your knight in shiny armor. <laughs> yes. So I, I would advise that you get a lotion that will give you at least 12 to 24 hours, you know, moisture yes so the second thing that nobody tells you about dr Till's lotion is that it is not suitable for dry to very dry skin if you have an oily skin or a combination skin or a normal skin yes you can try it out but if you have a very very dry skin i would say try something else i'll make a video on suitable lotions or creams that provide up to 12 hours or 24 hours moisture yes i'll do a video on that number one dr Till's will not lighten your skin or give you any significant brightening but if you exfoliate you get a radiant complexion and number two if you have a very dry skin or a dry skin try something more hydrating that can last up to 12 hours on your skin so thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed this video and if you did enjoy this video please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you have not done so already so thank you guys for watching i love you all bye